The Isthmian script is a very early Mesoamerican writing system in use in the area of the Isthmus of Tehuantepec from perhaps 500 BCE to 500 CE, although there is disagreement on these dates. It is also called the La Mohara script and the Epi Olmec script. Post -Olmec script. Isthmian script is structurally similar to the Maya script, and like Maya uses one set of characters to represent logograms or word units and a second set to represent syllables. Topic. Recovered texts Topic. The four most extensive Isthmian texts are those found on The La Mohara Stella I shown at right. The Tuxla Statuette Trace Sapotes Stella C A Teotihuacan style Mascother texts include A few Isthmian glyphs on four badly weathered stelae 5, 6, 8, and probably 15 at Cerro de las Mesas. Approximately 23 glyphs on the Oboil mask, a clay artifact in a private collection of unknown provenance. A small number of glyphs on a pottery sherd from Chiapa de Corzo. This sherd has been assigned the oldest date of any Isthmian script artifact, 450–300 BCE. Decipherment In a 1993 paper, John Justison and Terence Kaufman proposed a partial decipherment of the Isthmian text found on the La Mohara Stella, claiming that the language represented was a member of the Zaquian language family. In 1997, the same two epigraphers published a second paper on Epi Olmec writing, in which they further claimed that a newly discovered text section from the Stella had yielded readily to the decipherment system that they had established earlier for the longer section of text. This led to a Guggenheim Fellowship for their work, in 2003. The following year, however, their interpretation of the La Mohara text was disputed by Stephen D. Houston and Michael D. Coe, who had tried unsuccessfully to apply the Justice and Kaufman decipherment system to the Isthmian text on the back of the hitherto unknown Teotihuacan style mask, which is of unknown provenance and is now in a private collection. The matter is still under discussion. In Lost Languages 2008, Andrew Robinson summarizes the position as follows Overall, then, the case for the Justice and Kaufman decipherment of Isthmian is decidedly unproven and currently rests on shaky foundations. What it needs, more urgently than some other decipherments, given its evident linguistic sophistication, is the discovery of a new text or texts as substantial as the one found at La Mohara in 1986. Topic Notes Topic Topic See also Topic Cascajal Block San Andres Mesoamerican site EPI Olmec Topic References Topic. Brigham Young University Press Release on behalf of Brigham Young University Archaeologist Stephen Houston and Yale University Professor Emeritus Michael Coe disputing the Justice and Kaufman findings. Deal, Richard A. 2004 The Olmecs, America's First Civilization, Thames and Hudson, London. Houston, Stephen, and Michael Coe 2004 Has Isthmian Writing Been Deciphered? Mexicon 25, 151-161. Justison, John S., and Terence Kaufman 1993, A Decipherment of Epi Olmec Hieroglyphic Writing in Science, Vol. 259, 19 March 1993, pp. 1703-11. Justison, John S., and Terence Kaufman 1997, A Newly Discovered Column in the Hieroglyphic Text on La Mohara Stella I, A Test of the Epi Olmec Decipherment, Science, Vol. 277, of July 1997, pp. 207-10. Justison, John S., and Terence Kaufman 2001, Epi Olmec Hieroglyphic Writing and Texts. Lowe, Lawrence, Epi Olmec, at ancientscripts.com Access January 2008. Perez de Lara, Jorge, and John Justison Photographic Documentation of Monuments with Epi Olmec Script, Imagery, Foundation for the Advancement of Mesoamerican Studies FAMSI. 
Robinson, Andrew 2008 Lost Languages, The Enigma of the World's Undeciphered Scripts, Thames and Hudson, ISBN 978-0-500-51453-5. Schuster, Angela M. H. EPI Olmec Decipherment in Archaeology, online, accessed January 2008. Topic external links topic Photographic documentation of monuments with EPI Olmec script, imagery from the Foundation for the Advancement of Mesoamerican Studies, Inc. High-resolution image of the Isthmian glyph table Tuxla statuette photograph Drawing of La Mojara Stella 1 High-resolution photo of the Co. Houston mask